Good morning guys, in a few short hours you'll be in your chemistry paper one. Um, so good luck with that, um, I don't want you to do loads and loads of cramming revision um, before this. There are a few things you can do which will be helpful like you know, just watch the whole topic video to see if you can just get it to sink in a little bit more. Um, do some flashcards on Quizlet on the bus on the way in, but don't do loads and loads of revision. Please make sure you eat a breakfast before you go to the exam. I know that your stomach may be churning, I know probably you don't necessarily feel like it, but even if you can get something small like a banana down there, that'll be really, really helpful for you. Remember, in the exam with relation to the practicals, we can expect unexpected things to come up. So if you do see something in the exam that you haven't necessarily come across before and it's freaking you out a little bit, please try not to let it freak you out. I know it's really, really easy for me to say, and when you're in an exam and you're seeing something that maybe you haven't covered in class, um, that it's really, really hard not to freak out. But we know this is going to happen. So if we know this is gonna happen, hopefully we can prepare for it a bit better so please just try not to freak out if you see something you haven't covered in class in the exam try and think about what you have covered in class and how you can apply it to a new situation because that's what it's all about taking stuff you know and applying it to new situations that's what we need to be focusing on um so good luck guys um i am going to be here with you every single step of the way trying to do so so much stuff for you um right up until like right up until the end of physics paper two um good luck with you i'm here with you the 